What's going on everybody and welcome to the Negra Entropy Chronicles. I'm back with another video. So remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe and click that notification bell to be alerted when I drop a new video. So, story time. Justice is not always served in family court. Now, I'm not going to use anybody's name, but this is an actual story that I found out about. Um, I got permission to actually do the story. And the reason I chose to do it is because justice isn't always served when you're in a situation like this. So this guy is a father. Been doing his due diligence to be a good father. Uh, even when his child doesn't live in a state, child lives in Virginia. He drives a thousand miles once a month to go see his child to and to there and then returning. So he's had her with him for quite some time. And he's been fighting for custody and having full custody of his child now he was not awarded full custody and the person that the child is going to be with is the mother but this mother is unfit to take care of the child she does drugs in front of the child the child is even stated that she's seen it done and she wants to live with her father this is what she actually told the judge and the judge still chose to give full custody to the mother. Now, the problem that comes in with this is because even when he was driving once a month, a thousand miles from Florida to Virginia, the judge said that he was not doing enough. Now, I don't know anybody that would put wear and tear on their vehicle like that consistently to be told that they're not doing enough. If you do not live in the state, is the same state as your child there is a limitation on how you are able to maneuver how often you can see a child because it does cost money so for the judge to then award full custody to a woman who is doing drugs in front of her shows that the, the woman is not capable of being a fit mother because you not only don't care for yourself but you're showing your child that these type of behaviors are acceptable which is something that a kid is not supposed to see they're not supposed to see you do drugs it doesn't make any sense now if this was on the other hand where it was or the shoe on the other foot where you see a man doing this and being awarded full custody people would lose their minds they would say how could this be done how can he do drugs in front of the kids and they he still gets custody you know the system is jacked up but when it happens to men they just be like oh you need to try harder so the man has to now work and look for or fight to see if he can get a different judge that actually has an unbiased opinion because for anyone to choose the mother still even when it's proven that the woman is unfit to take care of the child it would show in some cases that this judge is obviously uh incapable of making the right decision and even when I was asking questions, I was trying to figure out, like, where is it that he failed to show that he was fit? And I don't think it's that. I think there's a biased opinion where a man is doesn't have the ability to raise a child, even though he's got a fiance about to be married, all of those things. They always look at the man that he can't do it by himself. He doesn't have the ability to raise children or whatever the, the stigma is on men raising children it's always seeming to be that the women are the best option when sometimes they're purely not and in this case when a child says i don't want to live with her i want to live with my father you would think that this was a moment and an opportunity for the judge to be like okay this makes the better fit i want this child to grow up in the best environment and become an outstanding or an upstanding citizen in america but instead it seems like he wants this child to fit a parameter where he can fill up the prison system. Now, I could be wrong, but I've never seen a situation where somebody is proven to be unfit and they still win custody. So that was my thought. I wanted to get that out there. So, you know, it's not always as clear cut as people think, even though you prove that you're the better parent, you, pro you prove that you're fit for the job. You still may not get justice served in that situation. So I want to shout out everybody who took the time to listen to this video and you have a great day. Peace.